So I decided to do radiography because it links both the personal patient side of it, the way you show care and empathy towards the patient alongside the medical aspect of it. You can have this, this um, patient radiographer connection between the two of you uh, as well as actually seeing the medical side of diagnosing and, and um, discovering fractures and other pathologies that the patient may have. Because it's such a varied career, um, you get so much different variety in it. For example, one morning there might not be that many patients, the next morning, the next day there could be tons of patients. So it's very varied, which I love that because every day is different. You know, one day you can also get just a wrist fracture clinic and then the next it's a lot of um, road traffic accidents or RTAs and it's, it keeps you on your toes, it keeps you very active, uh, the day just flies by because you're always either doing something or finding something to do. It's never boring, it's always something different and that's one of the things that drew me to it. So one of the reasons that I chose to come to the University of Leeds was that they offered a access course called Access to Leeds. It's basically where you, in a certain circumstance, it might be that you've got family circumstances or financial circumstances and that they offer you a reduced grade entry. So for me, what I had to do was I had to write a short essay to them to prove that I was um, literate and I could, I could work in the academic way of life and then once I passed that and I did a short quiz, I had to get them all right for that, it, it's really quite simple, um, they made the grey boundaries for me lower which is very good because it took the pressure off a little bit, I know A levels are very stressful, I think it's in my opinion more stressful than university uh, exams so by having that little extra leeway with my grades really helped me take the pressure off um, applying. I thought maybe, you know, if they did this would I be at a disadvantage, would I not know as much? And that's not the case at all. Um, I think everyone is on the same level when they start university. Everyone's learning something new that they've never done before, um, as well as having these clinical aspects which is new to everyone as well. So it's like everyone's reset when you go to university and everyone's on the same level.